it's me, Olivia. And today I am starting a new game called Persona 5 Royal. This is one amazing game. I will be playing the whole game. I hope you guys will enjoy it. This story is a work of fiction. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. The contract has been sealed. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion, and ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. You should be able to get out that 
that way. Hurry! Dude, can he even hear us? Don't worry. I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker! Hmm? Wait a sec. What the? I'm getting a weird reading heading your way. Come on, run! The intruder simply can't be found. Where'd they go? Scum. They should still be in the area. Damn, where did you go? The intruder simply can't be found. You're quick. Where are you? Where did you hide? Where are they? No problems on my end. Where'd they go, damn it? I can't confirm the intruder's location. Than this right now. Joker, it's her! She's the weird reading I've been getting! relied on you so much that ends today your aid, senpai. Now let's win this! Persona! Ravage them! for them to track you down. You still have something you need to do as a phantom thief, right? Then I won't stop you. Since I'm not a member of the phantom thieves, I'm in no position to interfere. However, please don't forget the promise we made. Joker, you need to get out of there! Go, go, go! All right, let's do it. He's 
not alone. Find them and kill them all. to find some kid you have your teammate to thank for this you were sold out suspect confirmed The drug was too strong. Wake him up. Watch it! I don't like getting wet. No dozing off. You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! Come on, cooperate. What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Of course not! So, you're not that dumb. Which is good. Cause we get to take as much time as we need! <coughs> Destruction of justice, blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? should know your place. Sign here. It's a confession under your name. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions.
Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... Are you Prosecutor Sai Nijima? I just got off the phone with your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. Hmm. I thought I ordered you to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much though. Ah, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. His methods are unknown, after all. We don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. I didn't expect it'd be you. You'll be answering my questions this time. <sighs> Those bastards. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here, and I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. <laughs> True. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Start from the very beginning. You are held captive. A prisoner of fate to a future that has been sealed in advance. This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. I beg you, please overcome this game and save the world. The key to victory lies within the memories of your bonds. The truth that you and your friends grasped. It all began that day. When the game was started half a year ago. For the sake of your world's future, as well as your own, you must remember.
what's going on. Directions? Looks like no one's home. Oh yeah, Sakura-san's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, the belongs in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Hmm. Next, I need to. be going on. Didn't something similar happen just the other day? And down is uh, the name of a shellfish used in pearl farming. Oh, right. They did say that was today. So we'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. A what now? There's been a string of those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. It's none of my concern. <laughs> well, see you next time. Four hours for just a single cup of joe. So, you're the guy. Please take care of me. Uh-huh. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other and... Well, not that that matters. Follow me.
This is your room. I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. Hmm? You look like you want to say something. It's very big. It's on you to clean up the rest. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. Now then. I got the gist of your situation. You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her. He got injured, then sued you, right? That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. The courts ordered you to transfer and move out here, which your parents also approved. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. Probation? Really now? It's the word that applies to you. Your sentence lasts until next spring, right? That's why you're gonna be here for the coming year. Cause any problems and you'll be sent straight to Juvie. We'll be going to Shujin tomorrow. Where's that? Shujin Academy, the school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place that'll accept someone like you, you know? What a waste of my Sunday. Your luggage arrived a little while ago. I brought it up here for you. What the heck? I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Actually, the place doesn't look too bad, though it's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? I'm going to close up shop and get out of here myself. I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick from staying up too late. You got that? Give me that shit. Ow! I have to 
save her. <laughs> what a waste of time. You think you're worth causing me trouble? Huh? I'll... I'll call the police! <laughs> call them if you want. The police are my bitches. They're not gonna take you seriously. No! Stop! Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car! Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. What are you looking at? Get out of my face! This ain't a show. Get lost, kid. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car! deleted it. Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. So you've come too, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight! Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. What matters? Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. Ruin? I speak of the end to everything. However, there is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated, rehabilitated toward freedom. That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? Yeah. Allow me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justi. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like! The duty of Wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. 
It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. Time's up! Now hurry up and go back to sleep! <laughs> Goodbye.